Welcome, today we are going to talk about Elementary OS 8. What are the new features that is introduced in Elementary OS 8 and when it will be available? Let's talk OS 8. First of all, we are starting with this blog post from November 3, 2023. First of all, when it is coming out? They say it won't be released until at least April of 2024 and built on Ubuntu 2404 and I think they based it on that version of Ubuntu is already released in April and they take months development so I think it will be October of 2024 six months or so after April okay that's about the release what are the new features they are aiming for Wayland support as they say one of the largest and most ambitious goals we have for OS 8 is to use Wayland Display Server by default. This is a transition that we have been planning. They say we are in the final home stretch. In the early access program, they had an experimental Wayland session of Pantheon available to test right now. They are tracking issues in the GitHub project and Wayland will bring them improved performance, better app security, and open doors to support more complex display setups. Second feature, GTK4. They are trying to transition also to GTK4 and having apps based on GTK4. Few of their apps are near completion like App Center. And one of the exciting new changes is the update to system updates. They are now built in in the settings apps and the new update mechanism is super fast and includes an option to download update automatically. It will also let you know explicitly if security updates are part of the update package other updates to the system settings search in the system settings has been improved to return more relevant results and the titles of those results now reflect both the exact setting and the path also the system settings icon has been updated and system settings has been ported to gtk4 nearly completely it's completely functional one of the stars of the new features is the window manager. The multitasking view has seen a number of design updates, the most noticeable of which is that instead of a plain dark gray background, it now features a blurred version of your wallpaper that is either lightened or darkened for light and dark modes respectively. And the multitasking and workspace cards now have rounded corners plus the docs has a new multitasking features when multiple windows of the same app are opened selecting that app icon in the dock will open a window spread instead of hiding those windows other changes the login and lock screen now has smoother fade in animation and we respect your orientation lock settings and the login now is faster also files is being ported to gtk4 also the login and lock screen features a blurred background similar to the multitasking view and the number of improvements have landed in the window manager when running under Wayland and since Plank has been replaced they have now new animation while launching an app in the dock the dock is a fully GTK4 application and the system settings is now fully redesigned with a sleeker GTK4 look this redesign is much needed app center is also been ported to GTK4 and looks amazing I think that's pretty much it with OS 8 do you think this release of elementary OS will bring elementary OS back to the top because it's pretty much forgotten because it it hasn't been updated neither to Wayland or GTK4. This has been my video about this. Comment down below what do you think about elementary OS 8 and the state of it. Thank you for watching. Peace.